Start fast now. Start fast. Crank that up today, you hear me? Let's go. The New Orleans Saints are at home this week after taking a disappointing road loss to the Falcons. They welcome the Detroit Lions, not feeling too full of themselves either. Goff has dropped. Sack ball is out. Packers will take over. Despite both teams losing Week 12, Detroit comes into this matchup with the expectation label. Even in their loss to Green Bay last week, they still made it into the end zone a few times. Montgomery dancing, working his way near the end zone. Is he in? He is! Touchdown, Detroit! New Orleans offense, on the other hand, couldn't make it into the paint a single time versus Atlanta. Falcons coming after Carr. Picked up. Picked off! Jesse Bates! He's got a shot! No question! Pick six! Still, Detroit was supposed to win at home and did not. And the reason they lost and have looked subpar the last two weeks? Turnovers, which is a Saints defensive specialty. They are top 10 in takeaways in 2023, picked off Desmond Ritter twice last week. Ritter looking deep, lets it fly and it's picked! Second of the day for Matthew! Goff on paper rocked it versus Green Bay. Stats look similar to the kind he puts up in their wins. Two TDs, no picks, a rating over 100, over 330 yards, primo stuff. Here's Goff, protected this time, fires a strike, it's caught by Jamison Williams, still on his feet, spinning, Williams down to the 40. Paper in the field in this case tell different stories, he lost three fumbles too. Pressure again, Goff in trouble, steps away and runs, he lost the ball again! There's a fight for it at the bottom, and Green Bay has recovered. So in the last two games, Goff has turned the ball over six times himself. Detroit should be on a two-game losing streak. Should be. And it's all the turnovers that stand out. Goff, not good that time. His third interception. The battle between New Orleans DBs and Detroit's pass catchers is A-level stuff. Their secondary should make it tough on Detroit's passing attack. Goff and company up against one of the top 2023 pass defenses. Dobbs fires and a great defensive play by Paulson Adebo. Lions will test them at all levels. Jameer Gibbs, eight targets last week, targeted five plus times, six games in a row. Tight end Sam Laporta scored last week, 47 yards. Goff over the middle, fires, it's caught! for the touchdown is Sam Laporta. Lead man, of course, Amon Ross St. Brown, 95 yards versus Green Bay, has yet to walk off the field this year without leaving a mark. He's having a great season. Goff this time has time, fires a strike, and there is Amon Ross St. Brown with a big game. Lions run game lined up to play a big role in the outcome of this game. It did its job last week. It could be turned to more if Detroit wants to avoid testing New Orleans secondary too much. David Montgomery, the Thunder, 71 yards, over four and a half yards per carry, a touchdown versus the Packers. Montgomery dancing, working his way near the end zone. Is he in? He is! Touchdown, Detroit! If they feel the thunder, the th thunder, then comes the lightning. Jameer Gibbs, 54 yards, 4.9 per run last week. Here's Gibbs, that'll give him some rhythm, but a big seam and Jameer Gibbs on the first play. Saints defense hit for 228 rushing yards by Atlanta, 5.6 yards per carry given up, a touchdown, 5.7 per run to Bijan Robinson on 16 tries, 6.4 a run on 10 Tyler Algier carries, 5.4 a carry to Cordero Patterson. Cordero Patterson sneaks through, first down to midfield. If New Orleans defense doesn't stand its ground, or even if it does really, their offense better figure out how to not look like a bunch of groupies along for the ride this week. On third and goal, fades one, incomplete, miscommunication with the rookie Perry. Yeah, and this drive, Ends with a bit of a thud here. Saints didn't have a problem moving the ball last week. Almost 150 rushing yards, 5.3 per carry. Alvin Kamara looked great, hit at 4.6 a run. Here's Alvin Kamara, waited for the hole to develop and hit it hard. First down inside the 20. Lions secondary facing a Derek Carr who threw for over 300 yards. He's given time, tight coverage, and then Olave comes free and he's got it. Lions defense facing a Saints offense that ate a big fat donut in the red zone and they had five chances, too. On third and 15, Carr is sacked by Abakati! Makes it fourth down. Saints' fear of the end zone extends beyond week 12 as well. They've struggled inside the 20 all year. Wow! <laughs> it's oh, man. not enough!
Now, Atlanta does sport a top 10 red zone defense. The Lions inside the 20, only two teams have been worse, so get out the slap boxing gloves. One of the reasons Detroit struggle to keep teams from painting, their pass rush has been inconsistent. Zero sacks versus Green Bay, Jordan Love not a hard dude to sack either, and they didn't pressure him much. Look at how much time he moves a little bit off his spot, and then a really nice arm action there. Aiden Hutchinson sackless in five of his last six games now. Detroit secondary gave up three touchdowns to Love, a fat rating, no picks, their season numbers versus quarterbacks in subpar territory. Going for the end zone for Watson, he's got it! Carr had the three bills worth of yardage, but he didn't throw any TDs, got picked off once versus Atlanta. Picked off! Jesse Bates, he's got a shot! Chris Olave will give Detroit secondary a day, 114 yards last week, 90 plus yards in back-to-back -back weeks. This car beats it to a wide open Olave, is trying to put the Saints receiving group on his shoulders here. Taysom Hill, 55 yards receiving, 26 rushing. Kamara had 50 yards through the air last week too. Slipped away from Caden Ellis and took it down the sideline into Falcons territory. Lions pass defense has fared best versus running backs out of the three positions, holding them to a sub-90 rate, but they've given up a rating close to 100 to receivers and tight ends. Got a man wide open. It's Kraft who's going to walk in for the touchdown. Big game for both teams. Playoff implications for both. Who dat? One pride. Go to work in the comments section. Panel attend. Go to work on the screen.